How's it going guys? Shellblocks here. Welcome back to another Roblox Tommy Hilfiger event video. In today's video guys, we're going to be getting two prizes and today are both avatar emotes. So the first one guys is the Frosty Flare. You can actually purchase these for Robux. That's like I was saying, they are free inside of the game. So yeah, don't exactly spend money on these. That would be a waste. On my avatar, the emote looks like this. Wait, what? Oh, it glitched for a second. There you go. So it's like a break dancing emote. So this one is actually very cool. The second one guys is called the Floor rock freeze also 170 but like i said on the previous one do not buy these and on my avatar it looks like this so again kind of like a break dancing move thing yeah they're pretty sick and if you guys are wondering well why would you want a roblox emotes they don't really do a lot well guys one of the new roblox updates is actually going to make use of these emotes and you will be able to use them on your roblox profile there was a glitch where people were doing this like a few days ago unfortunately i was busy on that day so i didn't get a chance to make a video on the glitch before it was patched but yeah it's coming soon anyway so make sure to get these emotes and i promise you guys you will be happy you got them when this update releases so let's go and jump into a game of tommy play and yeah i'll show you guys how to get these emotes so just like last time guys make sure to select chapter 2 the bronx click on travel and once the game loads go and hold spacebar get to the spawn and basically what we want to do guys is search for the skeleton now i know where the skeleton is it's actually down here if you've never done this quest before i think it literally says quest on the skeleton so yeah, let's go up to this guy. He's like some creepy looking skeleton guy, which is doing break dancing moves. It sounds a bit weird, but it is kind of cool, I guess. So there you go, run over here and we can actually find the guy. So we need to press E to talk to him. And basically he is going to start our quest. It's called Pretzel Run. And we have to search for these massive pretzels, which are basically hidden around the map. Now I'm going to show you guys where the first one is. There is actually two in total. But for the first one, you want to go up here, just go up to the train station. And you basically want to go over here to the bridge. Actually, I'll tell you what guys, there's a shortcut. If you go up to your menu and go ahead and just reset your character and you go back to the spawn, then if you look to the right, I guess, and you go on this cloud here. So yeah, basically run this way. As you can see, it's this bridge. It's in a bit of like a weird location, but yeah, this bridge right here, this is where the pretzel is. I think in a minute, if we actually go around the corner, we should be able to see the pretzel. I probably should have jumped on that cloud earlier, but oh well, I missed it. I think if you did miss it and you're under the bridge like me, you can actually get up there. Yeah, there you go. We can probably jump on this rubble or something. But yeah, there's the pretzel. Can you guys see that? There you go. Finally, I got up. You guys can go a different way if you want to. But yeah, basically what we have to do is do the parkour to get to the end of this bridge. And that is where we can find the pretzel. So try to be careful not to fall off. I know it might be a little bit tricky, but yeah, this is kind of like a parkour thing. Like I said, guys, you can use the double jump. That's probably like the best way to get up here without falling off. So let's jump onto this part. Let's just jump across onto there. And let's jump down here onto this cloud. Oh god, I nearly fell off there. Stand on this bit, jump onto that. You can be careful if you want to, you know, you don't have to go crazy. And there you go, here is the pretzel. So let's just do a speed jump down to this one. And we want to hold E to actually collect this thing. So let's hold E, there you go, we got it. Pretzel run is 33% done. Because guys, there is actually another pretzel we need to find. So let me go ahead and reset my character so I can show you guys what the other one is. Then once you guys reset and you appear back at the spawn, you want to go back to the dance skeleton guys so yes we're going to go back down here to where the quest thing was so let's just jump all the way down here and i'm pretty sure guys all we really need to do is talk to him again then we have to get the second pretzel so yeah remember to talk to him first i almost forgot to talk to him and that would have been a waste of time so yeah let's go and press e to talk to this guy and so there you go he gives us the first award which is probably the um frozen dance move whatever you know the break dancing thing so yeah now we're just going to reset yet again and we are going to get the second second pretzel and to find that one you need to go in the direction of the rainbow noob if you guys saw my previous video when we were getting the rainbow foam hands then you know which way to go so yeah we need to go this way jump over the train tracks jump onto this cloud here then just jump across to here but this time guys we are going to go in a different direction so for the foam hand we had to go up here but this time guys we have to go this way and we basically have to follow it around you guys should be able to see the cars there's like a bus there's like a new york taxi as well yeah, we need to go in this direction. So make sure you don't fall off. I guess this part is not really as hard as the bridge one, but yeah, we need to jump across onto this roof. Then we need to jump across onto the bus here. And yeah, basically just follow it around, guys. So jump onto the taxi, then jump onto the airflow air vent thing. That's going to boost you. You might need to use R to dash just in case you don't want to fall off and start again. Also be a little bit careful on some of the clouds because I think at the end, sometimes you can like fall through the mesh. Yeah, 
yeah, I guess they weren't really made that well. But there you go. As you can see, this door is now open and there is actually a pretzel. So let's hold E to collect it. And there you go. I'm pretty sure, guys, we just got both of the emotes for free. Yeah, we got them, guys. Frosty Flare and Floor Rock. There you go. That's how you get both of them. Don't spend 170 Robux on these. That's way too expensive. Get them for free. And yeah, that's all you need to know. So if you guys enjoyed this video, as always, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one.